Uh, Scott, you're back in the Lakeside again, and the venue is looking absolutely fantastic this year, but what does Lakeside mean to you? Lake, Lakeside to Dart players is, is what Wembley means to footballers. You know, this is, this is our, our mecca, this is our home. For every Dart player, this will always be our home, so it's always lovely to, to, to qualify every year and, and, and get back here, because it, uh, it does every time you walk through the door, it feels like home. Uh, and you lifted the trophy, of course, a couple of years ago, but you've had an excellent year on tour this year, so I'm sure you'll be getting, uh, getting to get that trophy back. Absolutely, I really have had a good year, and um, you know, it's not been easy on off the board, but uh, on the board, it's been pretty successful. So, um, you know, we we just could do with that for another week. Uh, and it's Oliver Ferenc first up. He's uh, won his preliminary tie, so um, I'm sure he's a, he's a good player, and he'll give you a good challenge in that game. Yeah, Olivia is, is a good player. The, 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 probably the British public won't know him, but I've been to a few Europe Cups with England and, and World Cups, and he's been there, and he's, he's been quite a standout player. He's made quarterfinals of um, singles in these events, and, and you know that's the best of the best that are all there. You know, the best of their countries are playing in it, so he's no slouch if he's making quarterfinals at Europe Cups. So um, I won't be treating him lightly at all. It will, it will be a really tough game for me. Uh, just finally, how do you deal with the pressure of being top seed? Because you're one of the names that people will be looking out for this week. Um, I think you kind of get used to it. I think the first few times that it happens, and, you, and you, you see the bookies have got your sort of like third, fourth, fifth favourite, whatever. Um, yeah, you, you can sort of like talk yourself out of the game and it can make you a bit nervous, but I think it's happened two or three times now and I've walked away and gone, oh, I'm not going to let that get me again. So, so um, yeah, you, you just get used to it really, I think, and just decide that you've got to get up there and play your game. No matter what seed you are, if you're the number 16 seed and you get up there and play your game, you can beat the number one seed. It's just the way darts is.